Does any one of you here being stubborn? Oh. No? You? Okay. <laughs> well, I want to tell you about what happened of me being stubborn and when I was pregnant with my second child. Eight years ago, uh, I woke up 8 o'clock in the morning and to begin with, the sun was shining bright and the air was warm, touching my skin, and I felt, oh, this is the best day ever. And I was so quiet, and I thought to myself, I gotta go downstairs. So I went downstairs walking, and I saw the breakfast was ready. I was like, whoa, yummy, I want to have breakfast. <laughs> so I ate, um, 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 um. I was about full, and my mother was there, and she said to me, asked me with a curious question, hmm, aren't you going to, to the clinic today? And I said to my mother, responded to her stubbornly, hmm, mother, can't you see I'm fine? And she was like, hmm, okay, just so you know, all your things are ready. I said, okay, thank you, great. And then I was wondering, it was such a nice day to waste. And I thought, hmm, what I'm going to do today? Then suddenly, I came up with an idea. Aha, I'm going to do my laundry. <laughs> so I went to the laundry area and I prepared everything. I got the bucket and I had a tub and I put all my clothes in the tub and then I took my small tools and I sat down and I started doing the washing. There was a faucet and I turned it on and the, the water was flush. I started doing my washing. I like to do my washing, hand washing. And so I thought it was the best way for me to do it, don't you think? And then I felt like, oh, I thought I finally finished. So I stood up slowly, very gracefully. I was pregnant, by the way, <laughs> so I can't stand up. And then I went inside the house. So I went inside the house, wondering what I'm going to do next, and I saw a chair. And so I finally sat down, <sighs> trying to rest a little bit. All of a sudden, I felt a contraction. <gasps> Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. 10 minutes later, suddenly I gave birth to a beautiful little boy. And I had tears in my eyes, full of joy. And also at the same time, I felt ashamed for not listening to my mother. I could have had a better facilities in the hospital instead of giving birth inside the house. And if I only listened to my mother's advice, I would have a better time. And I eventually learned that I don't get a better benefits for being stubborn. And also, take note, also, Mother's knows best. Thank you for listening.